beautiful people what's up welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here welcome my name is Merv and today I'm gonna just be reviewing the free choice wig in style Janine she is right over here I have not yet tried on this wig thankfully I know every time I do a hair review for you guys I've already you know styled it and worn it and all that but this is the first wig review that i'm going to be doing fresh out of the box so i'm going to be trying to figure out how to style it how to you know customize it and make it my own so i wanted to do that on camera with you guys so that we could see it together hair fresh out of the box let me cut the tag stop looking like a fool I told you guys in my um, get to know me that I don't like to cut the tag off of things until like I'm ready to use it so <laughs> that's just a weird thing with me I'm just a weirdo get used to it people all right anyway so here is the unit Pretty standard as far as I can tell, fresh out of the box. I got this wig because I wanted something super natural, you know, kind of for, you know, everyday use or as long as, you know, a synthetic will last you. So that's what I wanted this for. So far, it looks like it's good for that. Not too long. I would say it's about a 16, 16 inch. I don't have that information with me. Let me go ahead and cut the lace. Cutting the lace is one of the hardest parts to me. I don't know how people do it like so easily on camera. It's hard for me to do not while filming, so while filming i feel like i'm gonna really fuck it up but let's do it together anyway i'm not gonna cut too close because i don't wanna i want to leave myself some room in case i freak it up but i kind of cut um not straight i'm kind of like doing a wave motion i don't know if you guys can tell but just to make it jagged so it's not like that straight across type of thing. Um, but yeah. It's hard for me to talk into this. Alright guys, so the lace is now off to a decent I've cut off a decent amount. It's not perfect because it's hard for me to do um in front of the camera but I think I've got enough of it down for you to get the idea I think this is supposed to be oh it's an L it's a side part that's why that's why it feels so weird on my head I'm like why does it go all the way up here and then the other ear flap is like down here it's because it's supposed to be uh, a side part all right so that answers that question let me show you guys the parting space Obviously this parting space is practically non-existent. You would definitely have to pluck this. Let's just add some powder right now and see what we get without having to pluck it. Not bad, you guys. I mean, for synthetic, not bad at all. It's a little puffy. Um, it's a little poofy. I don't know if we can put heat to it. Okay, so this can take from 380 to 400 degrees. So I'm just gonna get a straightener and straighten that out. So I flat ironed this side. This side is still um, in the original form. Has a little more kink to it, a little more bounce to it little fluffier but this side has been straightened out just a little bit I'm gonna go ahead and straighten out the other side and then we can do a full 
analysis together. Both sides um, straightened. Uh, what what are you thinking? I'm a fan. Definitely a fan for you know 30 or so dollars. You know you can't really expect expect much. Like I said, I haven't worn this, so I can't tell you guys about the shedding. I'm sure that there is shedding because it is um, a synthetic unit. There's always shedding with them. I'm sure there's going to be tangling also, but as for right now, um, for the first 20 minutes that it's been out of the package, it is holding up really nicely. Um, I like it. It's very full. It's very coarse. Um, low luster. It looks very natural. It's not like very shiny and you know, wig looking. Um, the parting, you can absolutely do work to it to make it look more realistic. I'm digging her, you guys. She's finally out the box. <laughs> you also don't need to do anything um, baby hair related. You absolutely could, obviously, um, but who the hell has time for all that all the time? Like, I really, I really don't. Like, I do it to my units because you have to to get them to look more natural, but so time consuming and so, so much work. So if you don't, you know, if you're not in the mood to do that, which I am not in the mood to do that to this wig, it's absolutely a throw on wig, which I really, really appreciate. And if you are in the mood to customize it, it's gonna look freaking lit because it's pretty it's pretty it's pretty good right now all right guys so here is the finished result um i did a little more work to the parting sorry i didn't get that on on camera my camera died but i just did pluck um the hairline a little bit and that was it and this is the finished result so i love her i think I think it came out good for you know for a couple of dollars for a synthetic wig it's definitely worth the investment if you're looking for you know something natural and fun to just throw on with very little work i think this is a really really great option guys. all right guys thank you so much for watching as always leave me a comment down below on what you think about this unit don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful or useful in any kind of way and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos from me i really appreciate you for watching thanks so much guys bye Here's my 20 minute intro to my hair review. Isn't it so fabulous? Don't you just love it? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, it's enough of that. Hey friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today.